Another major development today in the Delphi murder trial. That trial had been scheduled to start this month. It's now been pushed back to October. CBS 4's Russ McQuaid was in the courtroom for the ruling and some contentious moments between the judge and defense attorneys. It took Richard Allen's defense team only 45 minutes to push special judge Fran Gull's buttons before she agreed to reset the trial for the accused Delphi double killer until this fall in Carroll County. Special Judge Fran Gull and Allen lead defense attorney Bradley Rosie went back and forth at each other inside a Fort Wayne courtroom. Attorneys for defendant Richard Allen earlier this year exercised his constitutional right to seek a speedy trial for the February 2017 killing of Abby Williams and Libby German near the Monon High Bridge outside of Delphi. Gull granted their wish, setting the trial to cover 18 days, including jury selection, starting next week. Carroll County Prosecutor Nicholas McLeland says he's got about 40 witnesses to call and could have wrapped up his case by May 25th. But Allen's attorneys, Rosie and Andrew Baldwin, complained that that left them with only a handful of days to answer the state's case, and they need at least two weeks to do so. How are we supposed to deal with that, asked Rosie. They can put on evidence until the cows come home. It's not my job to micromanage the defense, answered the judge. I can't do it. If you can't try this case, in a month, there is something wrong. Rosie fired back. You don't know anything about this case. Chastising the judge for not holding evidentiary hearings and turning down virtually every defense motion that has been made. Then referring to his client awaiting trial in a prison cell, quote, every day he sits in that hole, new evidence is presented. The judge relented, dismissed the speedy trial order, and set new trial dates of October 14th through November 15th. Meanwhile, defense attorney Andrew Ball Baldwin filed another motion to have Gull recuse herself from hearing the case. Prosecutor McLeland told the court he was, quote, frustrated with the defense attorneys and their tactics. The next time we all go to court, May 21st, 22nd, 23rd in Carroll County to hear pretrial motions regarding the suppression of evidence. In Fort Wayne, Russ McQuaid, CBS 4 News.